Hello, and welcome to this video on Veeam Restore to Microsoft Azure, a feature of Veeam Backup and Replication. In this video, we'll show you how to recover a backup of a VM residing on premises to Microsoft Azure from the Veeam Backup and Replication console. The first step we need to take is to specify the Azure account on the Veeam console. We've already gone to the menu of the program and selected the Manage Azure Accounts option. Now we're selecting Azure Resource Manager, Deployment Model, and Global Region, and then signing in using an email address and password. As the restore process differs for Windows and Linux machines, you can additionally provide the helper appliances settings to be able to recover Linux-based computers. Since we'll be recovering a Windows-based instance, we can skip this step. We're going to the backups list and choosing the Restore to Microsoft Azure procedure. Configuring its settings with the Resource Manager deployment model, double-checking the Azure subscription, and selecting the desired Azure region. The next step is changing the VM size value, as by default, Veeam takes the smallest one. And after that, checking the storage account we'll want to use. Now we're also changing the VM name and letting Veeam place it into the new Azure resource group. Then, we're selecting a virtual network for the restored VM, reviewing recovery parameters, and starting the actual process. As the process takes a bit of time, we're speeding up the video and we'll come back here later. Now the process is finished successfully and we can check the VM status. For this reason, we're switching to the Azure console, finding a restored VM, and checking its settings. We're going to remotely connect to the machine, just to make sure it's running fine. We're using the same administrator account and can successfully RDP to the restored VM. As you can see, it's running fine in Microsoft Azure, and the recovery has been completed successfully. Thanks for watching. 